Congratulations to you on winning the uh, Nordic Music Prize. How did you, you react when you found out? I was totally in shock actually because uh, also when they started to say who was the winner they started with the voice and I immediately of course associated on a vocalist and uh, when I started to hear things about packaging I thought hmm, maybe and then the word jazz came and then it was obvious and I was really in shock and I was really happy that they used the word voice because an instrument is also a voice so it's really a good day for instrumental music I, I let all the ideas go I didn't make any limits so I said okay I'm gonna do one album no I do two albums or two, two, two CDs and then I do a Swedish artist making a book so I, I just didn't draw a limit in any way and just did it all the way and I think that was maybe a reason that made it reach out. I want to dedicate this prize except for myself, for, for the, all the band members that's been playing with me. It's actually a musician's prize. I, I really didn't think that uh, uh, I would make it. For me, the hope is that all the other guys that make jazz or, or music in, in that kind of territory will get the confidence to move on and go further. For me, it's, I'm just doing that, what I do and of course this means a lot to me because I get energy to move on further and do more, more music. I always heard when I was younger that it, oh, you should just do your thing and play jazz and nothing else. And for me, I, I really didn't care about that, and I did the opposite, and I realized that that was giving me power to doing all different kinds of things and getting influence from all kinds of music styles, and, uh, and I think that made my album what it is. How will you celebrate this tonight in Oslo? I have my wife with me. I will, <laughs> I will drink. Definitely, that's the only solution now. Celebrate, drink a lot of champagne. <laughs> I'm really happy. I'm really, really happy.